in this video we are going to discuss about networks switch so we saw the disadvantages of the hub so due to the disadvantages of the hub that it happens to the degradation of the network so switches are introduced here the problems associated with hubs can cause severe degradation to the network so due to this degradation to the network switches are introduced so to overcome these switches are being used instead of hubs so like hubs switches also used to connect host in a network so hub connects to host in a network the same way switches also connect hosts in the network and also it breaks up the collision domain so in hub a collision domain is created due to a host sending a packet at a time simultaneously it will break up the collision domain by providing single collision domain and also switch simply switches the data from one port to the another port they switch a unicast packet to a port where the destination host resides that means we can take a switch which has number of post and this hosts are connected through a cables and it will switch it will switch the data from one port to another port based on where the uh, the destination host is connected here and also they flood out a broadcast packet so they flood out a broadcast packet that means it will communicate through all the hosts which are connected to the destination port so you can see a simple diagram here host a host b and host c are connected through switch so here the switch breaks up the collision domain and create a single collision domain and here remember that each host in its own collision domain and if host a sends a data packet to host c host b will not receive the deta details of the data that means host a will send the data to host c through switch so the switch switches the data to the destination port and the destination host c will receive the data so host b will not receive the data you can see the complex switched and hub networks in the next slide so here the slide you can see host d and host e are connected through hub so here a collision domain is created so switch 1 switch 2 are connected between host a host b and host c so here the single collision domain is created so this is one kind of a network so we can see more complicated network here in this slide so here the more complicated network are one hub and three switches so here host e and host d are connected through hub and this network is connected to the other network through switch 1 switch 2 and switch 3 where host f host a host b and host c are connected so here it is a it's it is it is a collision domain and here it is a single collision domain which breaks up this collision domain and the data is shared between all these host simultaneously so we will be discussing about the networks router in the next video